Anderson here with today's winning entry from GWR Short Story Competition. So are you sitting comfortably for your Trakanori story? Great, then I will begin. This one is by Rosie Wilkinson and it's called The Animal Train. It was as the GWR train was pulling out of the station that it first caught my eye. I couldn't believe what I was seeing. It was an animal train. The driver was a monkey. The waiters were penguins and the passengers were bears, elephants, dogs, cats and more. I jumped in a taxi and went to the next stop to explore the train. When I got on, a walrus with a curly moustache and big long teeth punched my ticket. When I sat down, I sat next to an ostrich, kept on pecking at me. When I went to the buffet car, there was a hippo serving me. They had raw fish, grass, manure and insects so I skipped that one out. I went to go and see the driver to see if he was a human like me or an animal like the rest of them and sure enough it was an animal. The driver was a monkey and when I stood next to him he asked for bananas from me. In fact he asked everyone who stood next to him. He asked for bananas even though he'd still got loads. I walked back to my seat and when I sat down I realised there was something magic about this train. The driver could speak and then suddenly all of the other animals started to speak as well. I was amazed. Once I'd figured all this out, everyone, even the conductor and the penguins, stopped doing their job and were dancing up and down the train. I felt like I should join in. When I was in the middle of dancing and my legs started to change, I didn't really care at that point. I was having too much fun to care. Then suddenly my arms had disappeared, but I really didn't notice. Then my whole body had disappeared. It was now all grey and enormous. I did notice that I had turned into an elephant. I saw my home at last and thought I should show mum and dad I was an elephant. But as soon as I got off the animal train, I was myself again. But when I turned around, there were no train tracks, no train itself. Was it all in my imagination or had it really been there? I looked down at my feet and saw lots of banana skins. Perhaps it had been real.